received a question from a community member about the Rico Theta app, the desktop app, and how to install plugins with it. The app was recently updated on October 13th, and I haven't tried out the 318 yet. So I just downloaded it right here, installed it, and let's give it a go. So I want to get a move on here to publish the video because I'm just testing the ability of the store to work with this plugin here. Uh, the, the store to work with the application, which does appear to work. Currently the camera is disconnected with a USB cable. Installation was complete. And this voice trigger capture is now installed. So we'll go back to the camera and here I'm going to Select it from the interface uh, voice trigger capture. Yes. It does appear to take the picture when I say yes, but uh, not when. So right now I'm speaking. If I say yes softly, it doesn't appear to get it, which, which is the desired effect, I think. And then if I shout, yes. Yes. Appears to work. So I'm gonna look for the images. I will press and hold the side mode button. So it gets it out of the plug-in mode and I think these are the ones I just took. I guess I should use something to verify. Maybe I should hold an object. I'll, I'll hold a, uh, a small tripod so I can make sure that it's, it's the image that I am taking. So I'm going to go back to the plugins. I'll select this voice trigger capture one and I'm going to hold a tripod like right next to the camera. Yes. Okay. Now I'll press and hold the side mode button. And the Looks like it's working. All right, so why wouldn't it work for this other guy? Well, okay, I'm running version 3.18. You might have to uninstall, completely uninstall the, this app and then try to reinstall it. Another one could be the USB cable. Uh, you might want to use the original cable that came with the camera. I, I know people often lose it. I'm actually not using the original cable, but um, I test the camera quite a bit, so I know my cable works. Those might be the two culprits. And then the other one would be to update the firmware of the camera. But let me at least publish this video. I'll, I'll tell the guy on the forum or, or uh, the person on the forum that we've got it working so far. Then we can try to debug his problem a bit more. 